Hey, what is going on, guys? Welcome to another video. Uh, as you can see by the title, something I left in a community post yesterday, which was something bad is coming, and I'm not sure how long I'll keep playing this. And what I meant by that, I don't know if I'm actually supposed to say or supposed to give quotes here, but uh, PC is going to be crossplay with console soon or in the future. And I'm going to get into why I think this is a bad idea and why I think this is something that shouldn't happen. Not because, oh, oh PC players are so much better and we're going to get our ass kicked. No, hacks are prevalent. I played PC for like, what is it? Just a week and I ran into a bunch of hackers, so I don't really want to play Warface when it's just going to be like consumed by cheaters. And yeah, don't get me wrong, like you could kind of call console players cheaters the amount of fucking aim assist we have. Like an absurd amount of aim assist. Which is true, I do 100% believe that. The aim assist is way too strong. But. According to the community manager, PC is going to be implemented in crossplay in the future as they want Warface to be one thing, aka one game. And I guess it's so they don't have to focus on doing specific things for specific versions of the game. Now, I personally think this is going to be fucking this is going to be the one thing that kills the game. I know a lot of people are probably going to say, "What do you mean kills the game, Ross? It's already fucking dead." To which, I know, right? But still, that's life. Um, I really don't think they should add PC into crossplay. Because, or if they are going to add PC into crossplay, at least make it so you you have to party up with somebody from PC to go against PC. That's probably the only way you could pro make it, like, even a little bit fair so you know you're going to go into those lobbies. But they won't because it's Warface and... To be fair, they made their mistake with Nintendo Switch. Now I know people are like, what do you mean their mistake? Like, frame rate means a lot, okay? Before anyone says, but Rose, anything past 60 is just stupid. No. As someone who's played on 144 for a lot of like years, um, believe it or not, it's a lot easier to get targets and visual information at higher refresh rates. Now, that also means reduced input lag, which by the way, I've already mentioned is something prevalent to certain games, especially Twitch shooters like this. And what I mean by Twitch shooters, I mean something that you have to like focus on and snap into the corner basically. But the thing I was on about yesterday about the whole like something horrible is coming is definitely, it was mainly the PC crossplay version because I know they don't really fix things that are like 100% dead with the game like they they released crossplay for switch and it was immediately like immediately just reprimanded and what I mean by that is I couldn't get the words I couldn't think of the words probably but it was immediately just like cancelled by the switch community because saying like oh my god but the frame rate is so different and stuff like that and everything which I agree by the way it was and it still is and I don't know if they finally implemented the whole turning off crossplay for switch the only downside to turning off crossplay for certain platforms is they will die a lot faster while crossplay is meant to increase the lifespan of a game I really don't think that they'll be able to increase the lifespan by adding PC into it because there's just so many hackers as well as just aim assist on console is something fucking stupid. It's not like other games aim assist. Like this game has bullet magnetism, which if you don't know, you can aim near their head and their bullets will just magnetize to their fucking head. I've done an example of this in the past. Uh, if you guys want me to do another analysis of bullet magnetism, then just let me know in the comments down below. But I really don't think I will stick to playing this game if the PC crossplay import is is like really bad. I just I don't want to see another fuck up, which unfortunately will happen. That is the downside of it. 
because it feels like no matter what we say or what we do, the developers don't listen to the community. And there is that. Adding crossplay with PC is going to fucking kill the game faster than it makes it better. I mentioned reasons why. There is probably more reasons why that people probably say. If you have your reasons, let me know in the comments down below. But they are literally trying to implement crossplay with PC, and that's going to be a bad thing. If you didn't know, I'm currently playing on the Xbox version right now. That is because. That a... Okay, he was dead. But yeah. There's less input delay on the Xbox version, which is fucking hilarious. So, what do you guys think about adding crossplay in PC? Do you guys think it's something stupid? Do you guys think it's not going to be a big deal? In the end, it's going to be a bunch of people complaining about hacks, aimbot, and aim assist. It's not going to be something that's like, oh my god, yay, thank you, we always wanted this. No, what we want is a fucking functioning party system where you can just play with your friends from other consoles. We don't even have that, and yet they're like, oh, we should really add PC into the mix. That'll make things better. No. No, it would not, and everyone fucking knows this. They don't care from what it looks like. They plan on implementing it in the future. I don't know how long that's going to be. In Warface terms, future is probably like seven years from now. But it was said, and I wanted to let you guys know what would be happening. Because I don't like leaving you guys in the dark. I don't even know if I was actually supposed to make this video, or if I was allowed. But I really do feel like I have to do this video to let you guys know about what's happening. I don't think it's fair, if that makes any sense. I don't. I, I really just don't think it's fair if they add PC. I know people are going to say, but you put mouth and keyboard, bro. <laughs> you have no fucking, your voice, your choice is invalid. I don't give a shit what I use. I'm not thinking in the perspective of me. I don't care about me. I'm thinking about other people that just enjoy the game and play it the way they want to play it. It's it's just going to be a big shit show. Like, it's not even the balance side of it. Like, I get it. I get it. PC, mouse, keyboard, yada yada, fucking thing. The only thing, like, the main issue I have with it is, one, there's hackers. Look at Warzone. And two, aim assist for console players. Not every PC player can snap to someone's head and keep it there, while console players can. And I know that people will be like, that's bullshit, Ross, but nope, that's my opinion. If you don't like my onion, you're more than likely to chop it up and dice it and throw it away, because I don't care. I'm just letting you guys know what's happening, and hopefully you guys can see it in yourselves to make decisions on what you want, or decisions that you just think are your own. Maybe you want to move on to a different game. Maybe. I mean, as soon as Crossfire X comes out, you bet your ass I'm going to give that a try. But, man, crossplay is a good thing if implemented correctly. And I really don't think that, the, that Warface will implement it correctly. I just don't see that happening. I really don't. Because they've already shown with Switch that it doesn't care how it runs. They don't care as long as they can fill their pockets pretty much. Well, that's my take anyway. But, the video is nearly over. If you haven't already, hit that like, comment, and download. Not download? Download button? What? Download button. Hit that like, comment, and subscribe button is what I meant to say. If you like the video, if you want to see more, just let me know in the comments down below. How long do you guys think Warface is going to last? Because it's already dying and this is probably just going to make it worse. So, Hopefully, they see sense in what they say and PC will not be added. Or they fix a bunch of shit and actually get an anti-cheat that works. And then maybe fix the aim assist as well because... Yeah, it's, it's bad. It is bad. So, like I said, if you haven't already, hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. I really appreciate it. You guys are fucking awesome. And, yeah, don't forget to mention in the comments what your opinions are. And if you want to 
support the channel hit that join button that's next to it for one dollar a month you can get exclusive things but yeah thank you so much for watching and i will see all of you guys in the next one